Our dialogue with models going into this casting for Victoria's Secret is what are you going to give during that 30 seconds of when Ed, Monica, Sophia, John all see you? Every year it, it gets more competitive than the year before, yeah. just like every other piece of the show does. It's a constant state of evolution and improvement. It's going to be really hard to do the edit because I've never put so many A's on a page before. They're all working out. So many of them are boxing, so many of them are doing Pilates. We're looking for well-proportioned, beautiful skin, great personality, which is quite unique and rare. But we've never been at this point in the game and had so many choices. When you see all these girls, like you want to be inspired. Yeah. And some of the girls come in and you're just like, ah! Yeah. Everyone gets excited. And that's it. You think, wow, she's, she's captivating. That extra little element that makes it brilliant. Memorable. To walk in the Victoria's Secret show is the most competitive. You cannot compare it to anything else. To any ready-to-wear show from New York to Milan to Paris, it doesn't compare. What the girls' exposure is to be able to be confirmed for that show is such a massive skill of visibility that you could want as a model. To get the Victoria's Secret show is like a dream come true. It's like the fashion show of the year and it's such a hard process to get in and you know, it's not only the casting you're working out for months before and you're like training hard and eating right, so to get in, it's like a culmination of a lot of work and a lot of dreams. I think it's a great show. It's very good energy, you know, like the people, the casting director, the vibe. I worked for them before and the energy for me is very important. I'm Brazilian, I know so much. I don't know <laughs> <laughs> This is my second time, so now I'm more relaxed, and I hope so. When do you know when the girl has it? There's so many different variables that are part of it besides what the outside is saying. It's this energy that they exude, because that's the whole thing. It's the interaction between the client and you know whoever it is, whether it's a photographer, the stylist, it's the energy, and if does that girl have what it takes to last and stick around. You're very serious. <laughs> you need to get a bit more of a toothy smile. Okay. How are you? Mary Sophia, Monica. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Slow down a little bit, lovely. It's like I can give it. I can okay. do it. So wow, composed. you look gorgeous. I like your Good. little bob as well. Victoria's Secret is all about the power of the woman, about the attitude about feeling confident, about feeling sexy, feeling beautiful. That's what I like. For Grace and Yumi and Taylor going into this casting, we knew aesthetically it would work. We practice and we say, you know, look, you've got to be fearless. If this is what you want, it's dedication. It's the Super Bowl. But those three girls have a lot of personality. I mean, Grace is, she walks in the room and the room lights up. When my agent called me and told me that I had this casting, I was kind of like, okay. This is something new, this is fun, let's do it. <laughs> what I like about Grace is that she started out as like cool Givenchy, like not a sexy girl, and she's become yeah. this like... Woman -like. But I like yeah. the fact she invested in today, yeah. like yeah. Totally. Donna. Hey. And was here at 9.58 a.m. Oh, she's Perfect. in. She's, she's in. early, she's in. She was on That's time. All you need. John is taking the contract models and moving them onto the permanent board. We just need to start the process of knowing who for sure is in the show and then start adding it so that we can look at the mix and see what it looks like overall. She's so beautiful. Mm. Yeah. She's a little bit How on the petite side. I'm getting text messages from agents that say, what is happening? <laughs> At the end, it actually gets more disciplined and you're just more ruthless about it. These three were amazing. I don't think she's a certainty at this moment. Really? I've only got four more slots, so... 
we have to take the emotion out of it because yeah. we know all of them and everyone has a story, but we have to look at what works in the show, what works in the outfits, what works in the themes, and not think about the girl because otherwise they'd all be in the show.